morning people today i think i'm gonna do like a little day in my life slash what's in my purse full disclaimer i've already gone through most of the day without filming but i will explain to you what i've done so far i took rocky to the vet because he's been having some bowel issues i think he's constipated the vet gave him some medicine he got a little rectal exam he did not like it but hopefully the medicine works i also did some laundry and cleaned a little and that's kind of it <laughs> yeah hung out with dylan for a little we had breakfast together anyway so right now i'm running to trader joe's i just went grocery shopping for food so i don't need food but i need to get flowers because i really want flowers i have dried up flowers on my desk and i want to replace them with some fresh ones and i've been seeing on tiktok a lot of girls have been getting these baby's breath that are like colorful so i want to see if my trader joe's carries those and then i also need to get a bottle of wine because my friend claire just had a birthday i already bought her gift but i also want to get her a bottle of wine who knows maybe i'll get myself a bottle of wine also today, I'm using my Teddy Blake bag. I absolutely love it. It is the perfect size for running errands. This bag is probably one of my favorites because first of all, the color, I love green. I've mentioned this like a million times, but it's like on my New Year's resolution list to wear more green. So this is perfect. It's premium Italian leather, so it's real leather so it's really good quality it's actually made in the same factory as a lot of other luxury brands but teddy blake is a way more affordable price so if you want a nice bag but you don't want to spend thousands of dollars teddy blake is a great alternative also teddy blake has so many different designs this is like one of many green bags and they also have a bunch of other colors basically all the colors of the rainbow as well as black white and brown and other patterns and whatnot so yeah run to teddy blake 10 out of 10. they have so many different sizes shapes designs colors all of them really good quality really cute if this bag is not your style they for sure have a style that you'll like I just don't have any bags that are big but like cute you know like i have totes like canvas totes and stuff like that but i don't have any good quality nice bags that are big enough to fit all the things that i carry in it and trust me i carry a lot of things in it also what's super nice is if you don't want to carry it like this they also give you sorry i'm making such a wreck they also give you like a strap for you to you know put it on and then you can carry it as a shoulder bag too which is a lot easier sometimes when i am like running errands and i don't have a cart or something i can have like free hands but anyway i am off to trader joe's now so i will see you at trader joe's Okay, so I just finished my Trader Joe's experience. I was in there for less than 10 minutes, which is amazing, and I stuck to exactly what I needed. I didn't see the colored baby's breath that I was talking about, so I just got normal baby's breath. Baby's breath, I think, are my favorite type of flowers. And then also, I got some white tulips, and then I got a birthday card for my friend, and I got her a bottle of wine. And now, I will be going back home. Okay, so these are my dried up flowers that I am replacing. So I put the baby's breath with the tulips and the tulips haven't blossomed yet. So I'm super excited for when they do. Also, this is like a vintage vase. It's not uh, dirty. So just so you know, I'm going to do my what's in my bag now. Welcome back. Da -da -da -da. So now I thought that I could do a what's in my bag or what's in my purse type situation. This has been requested. I don't know why. Um, I actually didn't even know that this was like a thing, like a trend or whatever. But I'm just gonna go for it, I guess. I feel like this will potentially be really embarrassing. But without further ado, here we go. So once again, this is my Teddy Blake purse. It looks really big for like an everyday purse, but it just fits everything that I need, especially now that I have Rocky. It's just the perfect size. 
His leash and harness aren't in here right now, but usually I'd keep that in here. Sometimes I even keep food or like treats. You'll see why I need a big bag. Okay, here we go. So first I have some sunglasses. Also, I don't really know how to do this, so I'm just literally gonna say what's in my bag. Sunglasses for a sunny, sunny day. People with light eyes need to wear sunglasses more than people with dark eyes because our eyes are more sensitive. Someone left these at my house and I don't know who, so no one ever claimed them and now I wear them. Otherwise, I'd tell you where I got them. Okay, another pair of sunglasses. These ones are Princess Polly. Okay, this is a hand cream that I really like. It smells really good. Eucalyptus and Spearmint. This is one of my favorite scents. Okay, this is body cream. As you can see, I am extremely hydrated and moisturized. Okay, next I have a hair clip. I got this from TJ Maxx. Okay, next I have a pack of gum. Okay, this is really embarrassing actually. And before I show this, <laughs> I feel like I have to explain. I'm like 24 going on 94. I have a lot of old person tendencies. I don't know, I just, I'm kind of an old person. And along with that, I have a lot of issues. One of them being, I have stomach issues. But it's like Pepto-Bismol, but it's just a CVS brand because Dylan convinced me that I didn't need to get the name brand. So yeah, I have stomach issues. I don't really feel the need to elaborate on that, but let's just say there's a lot going on. Okay, I'll elaborate a little bit. I just get really bad stomach aches because I get really anxious sometimes. So yeah, that's that. And then also, I have ibuprofen. <laughs> I bought this at Target. It's a ginormous thing. I also keep it at my bedside because sometimes I get headaches while I'm in bed or sometimes I'm in pain. Right now my back is really hurting. <laughs> and then I have a lot of lip products. These two are Charlotte Tilbury. Okay, and then these, I have a lot of, it's from Uoma, Uoma Beauty. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but they sent me a package with a ton of stuff and I've been really loving their lip stuff. So I keep a lot of those. I also have a lot of these mini Buxom lip glosses. I really like Buxom because I feel like it really stays on your lips. Okay, and then I got a lot of tampons. And then I also have a pad. I never used to carry around pads, but then one time I went to a party and a girl asked me if I had a pad and I was like, no, but I have a tampon. And she said she didn't wear tampons. And I felt so bad that I did not have a pad and that I could not help her. So now I carry around pads just in case someone else needs them. <laughs> oh, this is the receipt from Rocky's vet visit. My wallet, my keys. He buries his bones in the pillows. And then when Dylan and I go to bed, we like find bones in our pillows. Okay, speaking of bones, I also have a dog bone. Okay, next I have AirPods. Okay, next I have a band-aid. Blue light glasses. I actually get a lot of comments on where I got these and I'm pretty sure it's from a company called The Book Club. Okay, next I have my inhaler. Maybe you know, maybe you don't know, but I have asthma. I also have really bad allergies. I have some more lip stuff. Okay, this. <laughs> So I found this in my purse a few, maybe like a month ago, and I was kind of scared because I didn't know where it came from. And so I asked Dylan, I was like, or I told him, I was like, Dylan, like, look what I found in my purse. I was like, who was close enough to me to put something in my bag? You know what I mean? And he was like, oh, like Taylin made that, his little sister. And long story short, I guess she was making these and she put little Orbeez in balloons and then she put one in my purse. And I kept it because it's kind of like, like I get kind of, what's it called? Like when I get anxious, this is almost like a stress ball, but I can't squeeze it like hard because then I feel like the Orbeez are gonna all come out. So I just like twirl it around. Okay, no one needed to know about that. Aren't you so glad I'm doing this activity? Rocky wants me to hold him now. <laughs> Next up, I ordered off the kids menu a couple weeks ago at a restaurant and I kept the crayons. I don't know why, but whenever I order off the kids menu, yes, it, it it's not like a common occurrence, but like sometimes I do. 
I always keep the crayons because in my eyes, you never know when you're gonna need some crayons. Okay, hand sanitizer, more lip stuff. I went to a bachelorette party last weekend and I bought these penis whistles, but not everyone used their penis whistles, so then I took them home. <laughs> I wish I didn't just do that. So anyway, here are my little penises. Okay, these, I thought that I put these away. I have like a lot more and I put them like in a basket up here in my little shelf. So these are just leftover. I don't usually have these in my purse. These are penis lollipops. Okay, last but not least, I have poop bags for when Rocky poops and I have a hair tie for when I need to tie my hair up. And that is all for my my what's in my bag. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope that was entertaining enough for you. I don't know what I'm gonna film next or what I'm gonna do next, but TBD. So I forgot to record the rest of the night, but basically I made dinner. I made chicken and broccoli for Dylan and I, and then I took a shower, we watched a movie, which was horrible, by the way. It was a horrible movie, a lot of violence, a lot of blood, a lot of killing, stealing. I'll be choosing the next movie. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you for watching my beautiful video. I hope you enjoyed.